Hi guys, it's Laura from Mad Mimi's Crochet and Farming, and I am done with the copycat challenge. Check this bad boy out. Right there. Yep, yep, yep. Sin thought she was going to have me kicking and screaming, but uh, oh yeah, I did it, and I did it well too. Um, so, of course, what we were making was the mandrake. And here's the mandrake right here. He is a, a, a character from Harry Potter. Um, I think it's the second Harry Potter. I'm not exactly sure. Um... But uh, that was the pattern that Sin chose for me to copy her with. And I think I did pretty well. Uh, you guys all know that Amigurumi is not my thing. But um, here he is. There he is. His leaves are... He's got his leaves on. So... There's his leaves, and there's his his roots, his leg roots, and his hand roots. There we go. And there's some more hand roots, and some more. So, this is my mandrake. Isn't he cute? Well, sin thought she could outdo me. Yeah, it can't happen. No, 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 no. I couldn't let her win. So, um, oops. Oh, oops. <laughs> uh, I was wondering what that was. That's a, that's my scrap yarn that I threw in there. Um, so, Sin was like, you know, oh, well, we need to, or she made a pot for hers. So she did a Dollar Tree pot. I mean, did you see it? It was just made with plain terracotta colored yarn. I mean, what kind of pot is that? So I did my pot um, Pier 1 style. I mean, check this pot out. Isn't this just gorgeous? And then here's the, I do have fiber fill fluffed in here for him. And then here's the dirt that I used, um, or what I used to make the dirt. And I have some, all, I have some popcorn stitches in here. There we go. I, I, I went all out with this. No, it's not a competition, but, um, I had to copy her, so I did. And I normally make things larger than what I'm supposed to. So there we go. And then the mandrake. Oh, just fits in just like that. So here's my mandrake. Here, put your leaves back up there, dude. There we go. There. There he is. All righty. So let's talk about this mandrake. You know, it really, really wasn't that hard to make. Um, it's not a, an, I, it's, it is like an amigurumi. I, I think they, what do they call them? Like kawaii's or kawaii. They're like the little flat amigurumi things. You know, and it wasn't too bad. So, I actually enjoyed making, not really enjoyed, he was a pain in my bum. Um, and I did, you know, yell at it a couple of times. Um, but that's all right. And the yarn that I used, no, whoever you are, you can't come over here, um, was, and yeah, I got yelled at for using this yarn. Hey, I'm trying to use up what I have. Ah, 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 Tallulah, don't do it. She's, she just knocked over the trash can. 
I'll pick it up when I'm done. So the, the yarn I used is Lion Brand Wool Spun. And this is the color Honey. And this is what I have left after um, two skeins of it. And so I made the mandrake with that. And I used on the mandrake, oops, I used a um, J hook. What is that, a 6.0, right? Yeah, I think it is. So um, on that, I used the J hook 6.0. And this is what I have left. It's a five weight yarn. There's um, three and a half ounces, uh, 127 yards, 80% acrylic, and 20% wool. So I use two, and this little bit is what I have left over. Um, the yarn that uh, I made the dirt with, um, is also, um, Lion Brand Wool Spun, and this one is in the color Coffee, and from one skein, this is what I have left. I did not have enough to go around again, thank goodness, because... There were a lot more stitches in the dirt than there were in on the pot. And I used a, uh, a K, a 6.5 to make the dirt. And that's also why I didn't have a lot, you know, I think I made three rounds of the dirt. Um, the pot I used a nine millimeter hook and um, I use Bernat blanket because I'm trying to use all that I can of what I have here. And this is in the color Purple Haze. It was one of the colors made exclusively for Joanne. Um, and this is what the colors look like. Pretty color. I think I bought it because of the name of the song. Um, or because of the name, because it's also a song. So um, I think I used maybe about half of this. So this is going to go, um, all of these are going to go in the scrap bin um, and get used up. Yeah, so that is... Uh, what I have completed and um, yeah I'm proud of myself it didn't take that long to it took me in about two weeks uh, two weeks yeah I think I think it's like almost two weeks exactly because I started it on the third and I finished it today so once again here is my whoa here is my beautiful pot, and you can see the the dirt in there. Um, and here is my mandrake. So, there he is, right there. And I'll be able to use this pot for different things. And um, so, I have another copycat challenge coming up in February. Um... I will be working with Anita from YOH Crochet. And she has picked out one thing, um, but she says it's going to be really easy. So we might have to do two things. Um, so we will find out what those patterns are on February 1st. So um, if you guys want to make this, I'd love to see your makes for it. This is a paid pattern, it's in a book, and I will link the, the book below um, so you can get it um, if you want it. Um, I bought it and then I sent it to my friend Julie um, because I knew that this would be the only thing that I made from it. <laughs> so, um, 
Mandrake and I will talk to you guys later. He says bye, and I say bye. Thanks for watching. You guys have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.